What's up guys? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Dechuchi. Today we're gonna to be reacting to uh, Iron Maiden Rhyme of the Ancient Mariner Live Flight 666 DVD. Uh, I'm slightly disappointed in you guys because I thought because you guys told me that Bruce is a pilot, I thought that this performance was gonna be live on an airplane. <laughs> But it's not. Uh, I saw the cover full. It looks like they're playing live. But we're going to check it out and get into it. Uh, so without further ado, let's go. But man, how good would it be to be on a on So I'll airplane? introduce this song the same way that I did in a slightly lighter, more vulgar tone that I did at Long Beach Arena 1984. This is what not to do if your bird shits on you. The <laughs> rhyme of the ancient mariner! <laughs>
Okay, okay, wait. I swear, every single guitar riff they do, it sounds like, uh, it sounds it sounds like horses riding into battle. Like literally every single riff they do is like, dun, 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 dun. it's like it's got that kind of beat to it, which is cool. <laughs> to the Caribbean right now.
and they brought it back to the original uh the original riff <laughs> was good oh man <laughs> i have to say with three guitarists you can make some pretty interesting sounding guitar riffs and they certainly did that like literally every single riff sounds like you're riding into death on a horse <laughs> it's really cool um i have to say i think iron maiden might be i have only heard i've only reacted to to it or songs but they might just be some of the best storytellers in music that i've heard i mean i don't know <laughs> i don't know but the way they tell the story of like <coughs> the ocean and then the other one they had the the fear of the dark it just sounds like they could literally write this music into like uh spooky stories and write them down on paper and they would sell like absolute fire and in the bookshelves because they're so good at telling stories like imagine having bruce at a campfire next to you with a torch telling you like a <clears throat> some sort of like a scary story it would be amazing and it would sound probably exactly like he's telling it right now except without the music part but his voice is so exaggerating it's so um there's so much range to his voice and he sings like he's telling the story of the lyrics and i think that's beautiful i think that uh i don't think i've heard really i can't think of any other bands that have really done that and so yeah no that's that's fascinating to me oh I, I really thought this was going to be on a plane, though, <laughs> so that's my bad. I mean, I, why would it be on a plane? That's just so stupid. Uh, <laughs> I'm so gullible sometimes. Uh, no, that was a fantastic performance, and the drummer was really good, too. I, I loved watching him do his little stuff that he was going on with. Uh, the guitar solo was fantastic, and I loved uh, Bruce's clothes. That cloak slash coat thing is really cool. It's all like ripped to the arms and stuff, and it's just, it looks literally like he is telling the story. Like it's it's amazing. I love it, guys. Let me know what you thought of uh, 
this song and this reaction down below. Uh, let me know what you guys want me to react to next. And I will see you guys next time. Take care of yourselves. Peace.